A heads up, if you plan on visiting downtown West Palm Beach, more changes are coming to the city's parking. These changes will affect parking areas from the Amtrak train station east to Flagler Drive. This after outcry from people in the town. WPTV News Channel 5's Joel Lopez joining us now to break down some of those changes. Joel. That's right, Shannon. A couple of big things to note is that the city is doing away with 24-7 rates and as well as their parking tickets will now be reduced to $35. But the biggest thing to note is this right here. The hours of enforcement have been broken down into three zones. This blue area you see, which is along Clematis, down to the square, is going to run from 7 o'clock till midnight. A little further out in the pink is going to be zone B from 7 to 9. And over here, a little bit more east, or excuse me, west, is going to be from 7 to 7. Now, as you can expect, this comes as many visitors and businesses say that that 24-hour enforcement was simply driving people away from downtown. Even some employees expressed their concerns. It's extremely annoying to like go to work and then sometimes not even make enough money to pay for parking. So sometimes I'm walking out of here negative. I've also been booted down here while being at work after working 14 hour shift, come to my car and there's a boot like on it. Can't leave, can't go anywhere. It's important to note that the rates of the parking meters will stay the same and there is still no free parking on Sundays or holidays, but I'm told by parking officials that the money from the meters helps cover things like security, cleaning, maintenance of the garage and meters downtown. And right now the stickers are still not in for the new, the new rates or the changes in hours, but the parking meters will have those effect. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, Joel Lopez, WPTV News Channel 5.